Hey folks, Jay Wiggly coming at you again. We're starting a brand new Let's Play today. We are playing something good. We are playing the first Super Nintendo game I ever owned. We are playing Act Razor. Half action adventure, half civilization sim. Let's do this thing. And let's play it on normal. Cause that's what all the cool kids do. You want to be cool, don't you? I know I do. So, as the master, we shall be Sir... Wiggly! Of the Southampton Wigglies? Charmed, I'm sure. Yes, our little angel will be serving us throughout the entire game, doing our bidding and killing monsters and directing our people. Tandra. Not a very threatening name for a demon. And our power is depleted, so we need faith. It's Okami all over again. Okay. So, uh, the first thing we need to do before we start doing stuff is we fight monsters. Because if we do destroy all the monsters here, the people will be able to frolic in the fields. They can't frolic when monsters are eating their faces. It's just not cool. People like having their faces, is what I've learned. You'd think otherwise, but, but really. Battle. Alright. Let's clean up Fillmore. Okay, the uh, master here is is basically a god being, and uh, in order to cleanse the land, he inhabits statues. Which, I guess this is what he ow, looked like as he runs around killing things. He doesn't really have a whole lot going on though. He can swing his sword, he can jump and swing it, and he can swing it low. And that's about it. You get magics later on, but they don't really enhance his, uh, mobility at all. So, this is pretty much all he can do. It's all he really needs to do. His jumping's not that great, though. I'm getting wrecked here. But we're doing okay. Die, glowing bee. You don't belong in any world. Whee! Whoa. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, let's do that again. Oh, it's another game that has a timer. Great. What if I'll die? If I'm too slow. Alright, extra life. Whoa. Yeah. Let's hurry up anyway. Alright, and someone's gonna attack me. Haha, -ha, yes. I outsmarted you. That's just strange. Let's see. Yep, knew there was something cool over here. Don't know what I picked up, but it sounded good. I just like grabbing stuff. Ha! 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. Yeah, every stage is littered with all kinds of cool things to collect. Ooh, health. Plunge! And here we are already. It's a short stage, because it's the introduction. And here we have our well-armed centaur wearing armor that looks like a black knight crossed with a ninja. Aha! You can't leave the grass, can ya? Uh, whoa, whoa. He's not hard. I was just careless. I was careless because he's not hard, thus making him more challenging. 
What a fool I am. And boom goes the centaur. He should have armored his horse legs. We're done. Okay, and yeah, we're only at about five and a half minutes, so let's keep going. The game is, as I said, the game is half action, half town building simulator. First, you go to a new area and you fight to cleanse the world to make it inhabitable. Then you build up the town. Then you fight again to kill the remaining evil and move on to another town. So the game is mostly a uh, simulator. You can imagine this must have turned off a lot of children at that time. Not me though, because I was weird. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Alright, let's work toward a new piece. Speak, mortals. Alright. So, this is our little angel dude. That's a monster. He will suck. All of these are little respawning places. Kind of like Gauntlet. And, uh, they're not doing anything now, but once there are people, they're gonna start attacking them. And every time they attack, they either burn houses or steal townspeople. And that lowers our population. And that just ain't good. So, we're gonna have to start building. But before we do, I'm going to have to start cleaning the area a bit. So, first, I'm going to clean the area in such a way that will allow me to seal off some of these, uh, monster spawning, spawning, spawning places. Like right here. Alright. So, let's have them build. Here, 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 here. And stop there. It's a small move, but just start. You can move them a maximum of about eight places or so. And in the meanwhile, I'm going to, whoa, dodge that guy jerk, and uh, burn some more bushes. Yes, I know. Oh, 10 SP. Okay, gonna need a little more. Uh, yeah, your uh, SP is basically your MP for performing miracles. Each time you kill monsters, that little glowing ball that uh, flies uh, to your temple, that restores some of your SP. And the little hourglass up there indicates uh, when the, your townspeople are going to make a move. And you can't really perform any miracles while they're building. So all you can really do is defend yourself and defend them. So let's keep killing things. Burning things is fun! Okay. Alright, we have one house. That's a town. The dragon's not doing anything yet. The dragon likes to burn houses with the dragon lightning. He's waiting to piss me off. Speak, mortals. Alright, they learn how to kill things. Brings a tear to my eye. I like it when my townspeople learn to kill things. That means I've done a good job. These are not wusses anymore. And they develop a taste for blood. Monster blood. Which makes a great seasoning. I'm gonna cut off here. Be back in a bit, folks. <laughs>